I am Anil Kumar. Welcome to my series on exponential equations. The question here is, find the equation of exponential function whose graph will pass through the points minus 1, minus 27 and 1 and 3 with y equals to 0 as horizontal asymptote. I'd like you to pause the video, answer this question and then look into my suggestions. Well, if you try to sketch this, it will look something like this. It has horizontal asymptotes, y equals to 5, so let's say something like this, right? And the points are 1 and 3, so somewhere here 1 and 3, and then minus 1 and minus 27, so maybe kind of like this, right? So that could be the function, right? We are not very sure about the x and y intercepts, but we know two points on this graph, and these points are 1 and 3, and minus 1 and minus 27, correct? Let's call these points as A and B. We also know that y equals to 5 is horizontal asymptote. Now let's see how to find the equation of this graph. So generally, exponential function can be written as y equals to a b to the power of x plus c, right? Now since y equals to 5 is a horizontal asymptote, we know c equals to 5. So we can write this as y equals to a b to the power of x plus 5. Now we have two variables a and b which are unknown and we have two points so we can definitely find them. So now using the point minus 1 and minus 27 we get minus 27 equals to a b to the power of minus 1 plus 5. So this goes through a point which is minus 1, minus 27. So if you simplify this, bringing 5 to the other side, we get minus 27 minus 5 equals to a over b. So a over b is minus 32. So let's call this as our equation number 1. We can get the second equation by substituting point 1, 3 in our equation. Let's call this as uh, original equation. Let's call this as 1 and let's call this as 2. Okay. So when I substitute in 1 the point 1 and 3 in equation 1, what do we get? We get 3 equals to a b to the power of 1 plus 5. Or taking 5 to this side, we get 3 minus 5 equals to a b. So a b is 3 minus 5 which is minus 2. Let's call this as our equation number 3. Right? So this becomes equation number 3. Now a b is equal to minus 2 and a over b is equal to minus 32. From here we can solve for both a and b. So if I divide equation 3 by equation 2, what do I get? So if I divide equation 3 by equation 2, I get AB over A over B equals to minus 2 over minus 32. B, A and A cancel and B over B gives you B square is equal to 1 over 16 and that gives you b as square root of 1 over 16 which is 1 over 4. Now in exponential functions you know b has to be greater than 0 right? Since we know b is greater than 0 and not equal to 1 so we have to take the positive value. Now once we know what b is let's call this as our equation number 4. We can substitute this in 3, right? So sub 4 in 3. So which is b is 1 over 4. So we get a times 1 over 4 equals to minus 2. 
So a equals to minus 2 times 4, which is minus 8, correct? So that gives you the value for both a and b. And now we know that our function y should be equal to minus 8. b is 1 over 4 to the power of x plus 5. Is that clear to you? So that is how we can get the equation of the given function, right? So you can actually substitute the point x value of x as 1 and minus 1 and check if you're getting the right answer. Perfect. So I hope the steps are absolutely clear. Feel free to write your comment, share your views, and if you like and subscribe to my videos, that'd be great. Thanks for your time and all the best.